Yang Lihua was the oldest child of Sui founding emperor Yang Jian and his wife Du Gu Qie Luo. But Yang Lihua was born in the Northern Zhou Dynasty, the Emperor Wu's time. In 573, 13 years old Yang Lihua got married with the crown prince Yu Wenyun, who was the future Emperor Xuan. The Emperor Wu was a great emperor but wasn't a good father. Ill and corporal punishment didn't help Yu Wenyun become a qualified crown prince. In June 578, Yu Wenyun became the Emperor Xuan at age 19. Yang Lihua became the Empress and gave birth her only child, Princess Yu Wen Leying. The Emperor Xuan and Yang Lihua didn't have great relationship. To humiliate Yang Lihua, the Emperor Xuan promoted another four consorts as the Empress. So, except Empress in Yuan Dynasty, the Emperor Xuan was the only emperor who had five emperors at the same time. But the Emperor Xuan's ridiculous behavior didn't make Yang Lihua mad. When other four emperors fought each other to get the Emperor Xuan's favor, Yang Lihua did nothing to please him. This made the Emperor Xuan furious. In April 579, after worked as the emperor for 283 days, the Emperor Xuan retired and passed the throne to his seven years old son, who was known as the Emperor Jin. But the court actually still was controlled by the Emperor Xuan. As the retired emperor, the Emperor Xuan had more time to have fun with beauties. Apparently, the Emperor Xuan didn't have a strong body to enjoy this fun. In June 580, the Emperor Xuan passed away at age 22. Yang Lihua became the Emperor's daughter at age 19. Because the Emperor Jing was too young to manage the court, some government officers supported Yang Jian to help the Emperor Jin manage the court. Although Yang Lihua worried, his father's powers was big enough to threat the young Emperor Jin. But after carefully consideration, she decided to trust his father. Unfortunately, before the throne, family relationship was nothing. In February 581, the Emperor Jin was forced to pass the throne to Yang Jian, and the Sui Dynasty started. Later in the same year, Yang Jian killed the Emperor Jin. The Emperor Jing's two brothers and the Emperor Xuan's six brothers. So far, all Northern Zhou close royal clan branches were gone. With the Northern Zhou ended, Yang Lihua lost all her owners. Yang Jian felt really sorry for his daughter, but their daughter and the father relationship had no chance to come back. In 586, Yang Jian gave the princess title to Yang Lihua. Because at this year, Yang Lihua was only 25 years old, Yang Jian wanted to arrange a marriage for her, but Yang Lihua refused. Several years Later, Yang Lihua's daughter was ready to get married. Yang Jian required over a hundred qualified noble young men to get together in Hongsheng Palace. Yang Lihua personally selected her son-in-law, 
Eventually, Li Min was selected. Li Min's father, Li Chong, was a military leader and died in the battle with when Li Min was seven years old. Then Li Min was raised by Yang Jian in the Imperial Palace. Li Min was very handsome and had many talents. Later, Li Min and Yu Wen Ling had a grand wedding ceremony. Meanwhile, under Yang Lihua's help, Yang Jian gave a position Zhu Guo to Li Min. Li Min's fourth daughter, Li Jingxun, was born by Yu Wen Ying. Yang Lihua personally raised this granddaughter in her palace. Unfortunately, in 608, Li Jingxun passed away at nine years old. One year later, Yang Lihua passed away. Before death, she begged her four brother the Emperor Yang of Sui, to give her five limbs to Li Min. The Emperor Yang agreed. At very beginning, the Emperor Yang did take care of Li Min and Yuan Ying well. But in 614, the Emperor Yang got a prophecy that Dang Yu Li Shi Ying Wei Tianzi, which means a person from Li clan will become the emperor. Tao Li Zi, Hong Shui, Rao Yang Shan. Li Min's nickname was Hong Er. So the emperor Yang thought Li Min was the person who could replace him. The emperor Yang arrested all Li clan males and treated Yuan Ying to write a testimony, which was used to prove Li clan members were planning to rebel. Then, 32 Li clan members were killed. The surviving clan members were banished to Lingnan. Several months later, Yuan Ying was poisoned by Emperor Yang. In early Tang Dynasty, Tang Gaozu posthumously promoted Li Min to Guan Guo Gong. The surviving Li clan members were allowed to come back to their hometown.